Thank you, Julian. Business is booming for the floral industry, even through the pandemic, as many are sticking to the traditional gift of flowers for the special women in their lives. KZI 9 News reporter Kennedy Dendy wit witnessed firsthand how this Mother's Day in particular was busier than ever. We sold out and the phone has been ringing off the hook. This is what a typical Mother's Day looks like for florists and for the owner of Garden Girl Flowers. Even through a pandemic, she's grateful that her business can still meet the needs within the community. In this week alone, over 100 deliveries have been made. I grow a lot of specialty flowers in my garden that I use in my arrangements. And so that has helped me during this time too. Um, if I wasn't able to get something, I could go in my yard and pick something beautiful to make an arrangement with. I followed along to see what it takes to meet the high demand on their busiest day of the year, all while staying safe. What I learned is that flower delivery during a pandemic is a careful and strategic process. Each vase is sanitized and then left on the step, all without contact. And Julianne's daughter, Madeline, has been hard at work making deliveries across the county. She's been helping out since her mom's business began. I think people are stuck inside and they're not doing as much as they normally do. So getting flowers, they'll, it'll brighten their day. And it makes me really happy seeing that they're happy. And that's especially true for this mother-daughter duo who just want to bring smiles to faces within the community, especially on a day like today. Just helping my mom. I love helping my mom, especially on Mother's Day. I'll do anything for her. Bringing the love to each and every door. Reporting in Eugene, Kennedy Dendy, KZI 9 News.